What's up? Check out my uh, kitchen cabinet that I've got here. I'm prepping three days, four days out from the Iron Man. I've got all my supplements ready here for the half Iron Man this weekend. I've been putting this to practice, so do not go into an event, don't go into a bodybuilding show without practicing. Like I, I, I always would laugh when people backstage at a bodybuilding show would be drinking wine, they'd be eating gummy beers, trying to dry out, trying to fill out. I'm like, have you done that during your prep? No, it's like, well, you're wondering why you're holding fluid because your body's going into shock. It's not, has no idea, it hasn't become accustomed to that profile of that food or that liquid or that supplement. So I've been practicing these supplements in the lead up. Some have been removed, some have been added, and I found a formula that's working for me. Now this is a half Iron Man. This may change considerably for my full Iron Man, okay? But let's start off with, um, obviously before the swim, I'm gonna have a big carbohydrate based meal. I'll have some oats, I'll have some recaged in there, very light protein. So once I've got out of the swim, I go straight into the bike. In the bike sessions, I'm gonna have one bottle here that has my hydrocharge, my glutamine, my branch chain amino acids, and my citrulline. Now I'll have in here about two scoops of hydrocharge, making sure that I have my electrolytes, my coconut water powder, staying hydrated. I'll also have glutamine in there. Glutamine seems to be very well, work very well with my stomach. Now branch chain amino acids, I have found, funnily enough, this to be my key supplement when doing these uh, disciplines, I feel that I do not have the lactic buildup and I do not have the fatigue as I would uh, uh, with, uh, without it. So I always include branched chain amino acids as my number one supplement when I'm doing these three disciplines. So I'll have a scoop, one scoop, two scoops. When it comes to the citrulline, I'll have two scoops. I'll have four grams. Now this, I have, and in this bottle, this is another drinks bottle that I'll have on, on my Aero bars. This has exactly the same, identical, okay? Here, I have my nutrition, all right? So in my nutrition, I will have my recaged in here. I'll also have my BCAAs and my glutamine and uh, one scoop of hydrocharge, two scoops of the citrulline, and I'll have one scoop of the recaged in there as well. Now I'm testing some carbohydrates. Usually I eat bananas, but I've been testing a carbohydrate profile that I believe uh, works for me. So I've been testing that out and I'm gonna be testing it out on the bike as well, but mainly I'm gonna be eating solid nutrition on the bike as opposed to liquid uh, nutrition. So the run of these little bad boys bottles here. Now I'll need a bit of a pick-me-up. Now you can have pure calf caffeine by itself and you can have the same sort of combo shared between both of those bottles or you can do what I like to go for is the in-caged. I'll go for a serving of in cage because that's when I'll want to have that extra oomph, that extra amp of energy and have my caffeine which is my pure calf organic green bean caffeine. That's what I'll have there. When it comes to my solid nutrition what can I say? Backcountry bars. Now I'll have these strapped to the bike and I'll have a couple of these. Um, you know, they read completely natural. So all I've got in here are rolled oats, dried fruit, uh, natural peanuts, apricots, plums, mangoes, dates, uh, eggs, uh, pumpkin kernels, roasted sunflower seeds, bran flax seeds, uh, roasted almonds, white sesame seeds, honey, and vanilla. And uh, yeah, it's bloody perfect. And just one more thing here, okay, is another form of nutrition I'll have, and it's called the picky bar, all right? So the picky bar is real good, and Sam Christensen, local triathlete, got me onto these, and I absolutely loved them. My stomach was fine with them. And in these, the ingredient profile, again, dates, uh, argave nectar, bran rice syrup, uh, rice protein, uh, protein from whole grain sprouted brown rice, uh, walnuts, cinnamon, sunflower, whatever, you get the idea, but again, a natural profile. So I've tested this nutrition and make sure that it works for me. What I'll probably do whilst I'm out there, I may have to refill a few of these bottles, dependent on how hot it is. It's supposed to be very hot. So I may refill a couple of these bottles. For the two days before, in these containers, I'm gonna be drinking these supplements because I want to make sure that my body is continuing to be a customized 
to the supplements that I'm taking. I don't like to take breaks and then get back on them. I like to continue that process of having uh, the nutrition in there. As I said, it's gonna be very hot there, so when I go to the aid stations, I probably won't be eating any of the food that they give me. I'll be taking all the food with me, uh, but I will be taking bottles or uh, cups of water and pouring them on me, down my back, down my chest, keeping me cool the whole time. This is what I've been testing, this is what works for me, so this is what I'm gonna be putting to the test and this is what's gonna get me across that Ironman finish line so I can be announced, Chris Gethin, you're an Ironman.